Hi everyone, welcome to Investing Mania. I'm Terry. How a $1 million portfolio can be down by 62% in just a few short months? Let's find out. Earlier this month, I came across a post in a Telegram channel called Financial Horse about a 40 year old Singapore man who lost $600 over $1,000 option trading in 2022. After reading through this article, I keep thinking, I want to interview Jason, I want to interview Jason, I want to interview Jason. And I sent quite a long text to Jason, and on the next day, he replied. Oh no! Although there is no interview with him, I still managed to get him answer a list of questions. Do you eat carrot? Do you eat penguin? After getting his replies and reading through most of the articles written by him, I felt that there are really lots of lots of things that you and me can learn through his story. Like how he generated a million dollars at age 40, how he invests his money, and how he deals with the $600 over $1,000 loss mentally. Let's start with the first one. With $1 million at age 40, you must be thinking, must be from a rich family one, right? It is not true at all. Jason grew up in a poor family, but both his parents are very hardworking and taught him the greatest lesson to his life. That is, it is okay to be poor. As long as you are willing to hustle, you will not die of hunger. Yes. What yeah, you still playing Mobile Legends ah? Never go work, how we get money to buy food le? I'm so hungry le. Hey, uh, hungry on him ah, you haven't died what? You have been slain. <sighs> you see that? Since young, Jason has been working very hard. He worked as a food packer at his auntie's food factory when he was in primary school and earned $10 a day. He then tried on many other jobs during his school holiday while others were having fun in theme parks and Disneylands. In one of his articles, he mentioned, Hustle when others are relaxing and enjoying life so that you can relax and enjoy life when others are still hustling. Wow, you're still watching TV? Uh? What do you learn from Jason and go to work? Lazy rabbit. Besides hustling hard throughout his young age, Jason's frugal lifestyle has also helped him in building wealth faster than his peers. He doesn't buy expensive watch, doesn't buy expensive gadgets, he stays in HDB, he doesn't have a car, and he only bought his G2000 clothes on sales and not changing phone frequently. Whoa, Samsung phone lasts for 6 years. Is he really a human being? I think if you give him this phone, uh, he can use for 40 years. <laughs> wow, so by hustling hard and leading a frugal lifestyle, I can also have $1 million? Nope, but by living below his means, he managed to save up more capital to start his investment journey. In year 2012, Jason started investing with around $89,000. He followed some bloggers, and started investing into some Singapore dividend and blue chip stocks such as Singtel, Starhub, Semcorp, SPH, and growth stock like Marco Polo Marine. He made 10% profit in his first year of investment, but from year 2014 to 2019, all these so called blue chip stock prices started to collapse. It was a pity that he didn't stop loss in time and made a total loss of around $135,000 when he sold off all this stock in year 2021. But his investment journey wasn't all bad. He invested around $196,000 in Singapore bank stocks such as DBS, UOB and OCBC in year 2020 during the COVID-19 pandemic and made around $87,000 profit in close to two years time. But in year 2021, Jason started to watch tons of financial videos on YouTube and that is how he was inspired about option trading by Chicken Genius Singapore. His option trading journey started with a big gain, but followed by a big loss. Aiyah, uh, why never listen to me? I'm Lady Genius Singapore ma. 
The option trading strategy that Jason used were wheel strategy and leap strategy. Wheel strategy is my favorite and the one and only option strategy that I use. You can refer to this video to understand how wheel strategy can help you to earn extra income every month. I'll leave the link in the description below and at the end of this video. However, leap strategy Jason used is by buying long-term call options of Google, Tesla, Apple, Microsoft and etc. Hoping the price to go up and sell the options for profit. I personally don't suggest you all to buy options because it's like gambling. You never accurately predict the rise or fall of a single stock. And when the option expire worthless, you lose all the money that you paid to buy the options. From year 2021 to year 2022, before the big market correction, by selling off all his other investment to pump the capital into his indirective brokers account, Jason managed to use will and leap strategy to amass his $1 million portfolio. But things started to go very, very bad when the market started to turn bearish. By mid-July 2022, Jason's portfolio was down by $635,000 unrealized loss with $200,000 over $1,000 lost in value of the stocks he hold and $400,000 over $1,000 down in the leaps option he bought. The clock is ticking and the lips option are losing value every single day. And if the market doesn't turn around in 2023 and 2024, Jason's lips options will expire worthless and he will have a realized loss of $400 over $1,000. I asked Jason about his mental status when he has such a big loss. He said, I have tried not to focus on what this amount of money can buy me instead if I had not lost them because these thoughts are not helpful. I tried to tell myself that as long as I stay healthy and hustle hard, I will one day be able to cover back all my losses. You can see that Jason is still very positive even after the big loss. In his interview with Financial Horse, he mentioned this quote, Darling, you will make mistakes, but they will never make you. Having family support is very important after such a big loss. You should feel very blessed if you have a wife who will tell you the same quote. But if your wife tell you this, Darling, you will make mistakes and I will softly kill you. You better know what to do, huh? Jason said that if he can go back in time, he will study the US stock market more thoroughly from the start of his investment journey. Even for now, Jason will still stay invested after such a big loss. What have you learned from Jason's story? And what you will do if you have $1 million? Comment down below and let us know. I sincerely wish the market can turn around sooner so Jason can recover all those unrealized loss and make a huge comeback. Jason, don't forget to give me a treat yeah, if my wish come true. A big shout out to Jason's website, Learning Investment with JasonChai.com, which he shares his investment knowledge and journey in multiple articles. You can also get a book. Finding the Magical Realm of Happiness, written by Jason. I'll leave the link in the description below. If you like today's content, please give me a like and subscribe to my channel. You can also join our Telegram channel and group to learn more about investing and we will share daily hot finance news which might be useful to you. So that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.